think this would be a good spot. What do you think? Yeah. Yeah. Here, Gabe, why don't you have a... Have a go. They're nature's most talented gardeners. Wherever they're found, plants thrive. They do burrow deep if the soil is dry. They can burrow actually quite a ways down. Lumbricus, more commonly known oh, as the garden good. earthworm. Oh, there we go. Right. Can you get it? Yeah. There he is. The earthworms burrow through the soil, ingesting the soil. That's their food source. It's a big one. Yeah. Look at that. Yeah. They process that food and defecate it out the other end, the posterior end. In doing so, the earthworms, in burrowing through the sediment, aerate the soil to a great degree. That is, they bring oxygen down below the surface of the soil through their burrows. Earthworms can live up to seven years, and some species reach 20 feet in length. Their simple cylindrical bodies can push, pull, and slide themselves into any nook and cranny. With each powerful movement, they industriously burrow deep into the earth. Earthworms never seem to rest. If all the topsoil they have ever turned over was mounded up, it would cover Earth's land mass in a layer 300 miles deep, nearly 50 times the height of Mount Everest. In their burrowing, they alter the nutrients cycling in their habitat. A lot of the nutrients are trapped in debris on the surface of the sediment or the soil. The earthworms bring down this leaf debris. By cycling the leaf debris through their gut, they release a lot of nutrients in that food source to other organisms in the soil. They really accelerate the whole decaying process of the leaves by processing it through their one-way gut. 